Hello and welcome highlights off stage two of the Tour of Scandinavia, the Battle of the North. 153.8 kilometers today from uh, Molesund to Stromstad. Along the route, first queen of the mountains at Stenshout with 119.2 to go. Two sprints, Munkedal and Hamburg Sund. And the final QOM will come at Langestjo with 44.9 kilometers to go. It's a fast stage. Wind coming from the left for a majority of the day. Marina Voss going into the stage with a four second advantage over Megan Jastrup and Shari Bosite at six in third spot. Jastrup in the white jersey is the best young rider. It was Queen of the Mountains leader, Amber Crack, that took the first QOM points of the day. Jumbo Visma really going all in for this Queen of the Mountains classification. Crossing the line in front of teammates, Anusa Costa and Mariana Voss with Femke Hebitzer, her nearest challenger taking fourth onto the sprint at Munkadal. And it was Alison Jackson that took maximum points ahead of Aline Van Royen of AG Insurance next year. Real battle emerging between those two riders in that green jersey classification. On to Hamburg Sund and AG Insurance next G leading out of Van Royen who launched her move, putting her teammate in between. Genius move, it meant Van Royen managed to put some distance between herself and Jackson to turn the tables on the second sprint. They would rock and roll the way towards Longesio for the second Queen of the Mountains point of the day. Jumbo Visma out in force yet again. Marina Voss in the yellow jersey of race leader with Amber Crack and Linda Reedman, despite the best efforts of Femke Geretze and her Parkertel Valkenberg teammates. It would only be fourth yet again for Geretze. Amber Crack looking great in the Queen of the Mountains a classification lead, and we'll take that jersey into stage three. There were numerous attacks on the run-in towards uh, the finish, including from the Norwegian national team, but nothing managing to get clear. All the teams looking to try and bring it down to a bunch sprint. Oh. Unfortunately, on the run-in towards the finish, green jersey, Alison Jackson touched a wheel and went down, but the live racing extra rider would be back up and on her way in towards the finish. A technical run-in towards the line, a couple of turns. It was Lucinda Brand that was trying to lead out for Amelie Deirdrickson, but a real drag race, a long straight for the finish. It was Sweden's Amelia Farlene, though, looking to take a victory on home soil that launched her move first. And within the final 50 metres, Mariana Voss came through to pit the Swedish star on the line for her second stage victory of this year's race. Barbara Grishki of Movistar, having had a tumble early on in the stage, just like Farlene, picked herself up to finish third. Jastrab from DSM coming home in fourth place. Farlene, so near yet so far. It was almost a stage victory on home soil. Voss comes through at the line, throws the bike and takes the stage victory. There's your top 10. So Mariana Voss from Amelia Farley and Barbara Gregorisky, Jastra Manley, Dronova, Mackay, Bosite, Diedrichsen and Vollering, your top 10. Another day, another yellow jersey for Mariana Voss. The Tour of Norway, as this race was before, this was her 10th stage victory up here in Scandinavia. She had won the Tour of Norway overall on three occasions, and she now leads by 14 seconds ahead of Megan Jastra. Farlene now up to third, also at 14 seconds. 20 seconds separating the top 10 overall. We now head to Norway, our third country, in as many days for stage three. On paper, it looks like another one for Marina Voss. Mus to Sarpsborg, 119 kilometers with a real Kermes style finishing circuit.